Hey guys, Saki here from Saki Tech, and in today's video, I'm going to share a secret feature for the Pixel 3 and the Pixel 3 XL that is simply awesome. So let me uh, show you what I'm talking about. Uh, if you look at the bottom over here, you'll see a little man just hanging out in the corner. And when you tap on him, he gives you a bunch of options. And all these options are absolutely fantastic. Uh, it becomes like a little control center right at the bottom of the Pixel. So as you can see, we have all the options. We can actually uh, access Google Assistant if we tap that. Uh, if I tap it again, I can actually take a screenshot just by tapping this uh, button here. Boom, that's fantastic. And if I tap it one more time, I can actually bring down the uh, notifications panel uh, by tapping this button here. And of course, uh, if I tap it one more time, I have uh, the ability to go into the quick settings, uh, which, are, which are the quick toggles on the top. Normally what I would have to do is I would have to pull this down and down one more time to access this setting. And then again, if you tap it again, uh, you can actually lock the screen by tapping this. Uh, you can bring up the multitasking pane if you want to. And also if you tap it again, you can change the volume from here. That also gives you access to the um, settings over here, to the sound settings. So one more thing, uh, you can turn off the power by pressing that. Uh, over there, you also have the ability to take a screenshot. Uh, but you can also take the screenshot from here. And finally, uh, again, one of my favorites, you just tap this to lock the screen, and that's great as well. So how do you enable this function? What you want to do is you want to go to the settings over here, tap on settings, uh, scroll down to where it says accessibility, you'll tap on it, and then go down a little bit until you see the accessibility menu. You tap on that and you enable that. Now if I disable this, uh, the little man over there disappears, uh, but if I enable this, as you can see, he comes right back, and from here, I can do whatever I want. Now, the only thing that I, uh, I wish was uh, possible in this quick access menu over here was the ability to actually customize it and perhaps put your own little uh, shortcuts if you so desired. It would also be nice if you could swipe over and actually get a quick access to some of your apps, like a little uh, quick access app drawer. But still, as it is, it's pretty fantastic. With the new Android versions, uh, the back button and the recent keys button have disappeared, so you can access them like this. So that leaves this extra space here that is unused, uh, so it's a good idea to put this little symbol here to access these quick settings. Anyway, that's it for this video. Uh, if you do have any questions, comments, or concerns, drop them down below. And of course, make sure to subscribe to Saki Tech for more amazing tips like this. Uh, for now, have a fantastic day.